Let's take a couple of minutes and we'll learn how to change the colors and the illumination on Pioneer's AVHX 1800S. So from any of my source screens here, I'm going to touch the gears and we want to go to the color palette right here. There's the color palette. Let's start off with the illumination. We'll touch that and here's my illumination. This is the hard keys across the bottom, the color that you see here. Now we have a number of preset colors that we can choose from and when I touch a color you can see the uh, colors on the illumination on the buttons across the bottom changing. If you want to see the illumination continuously scan through available colors, pick this button here on the end and you'll see the illumination continuously change. For a very precise color adjustment, let's touch the uh, color wheel here. And here we can drag the uh, color markers to any color that we'd like. And if you're looking for something a little more precise, you can use the arrows over here. We can make this color either a little brighter or a little darker. So for right now, I'm going to go with a sort of a purple color. And I'm going to make that a nice bright color up there like that. Now I want to save that color. I like that. I want to use that in my car. So I'm just going to press and hold the memo button for a couple of seconds. That saves that. Now if I hit the X, you can see we still have that purple color across the bottom. Now let's go back in there to the illumination. And we can choose the blue, the red, whatever color that we would like. If you want to go back to the color that you chose, We'll hit the color wheel and touch memo again, and that switches it back to our purple. So let's go back up and let's check out the theme settings now. The themes are presets that adjust the overall look of the head unit. You can see the background images changing and the color of the buttons changing as well. We can see what the theme will look like on our home screen as well as the AV screens. So once you've chosen, chosen something for the theme, you can move on to the background. The background is the image that you see here on the home screen and back here on the AV screen. So for the home screen, we have a number of different uh, preset images to choose from. And remember, as you change the theme, these background images will change their color. And we can slide over here where we can import an image or we can completely black out that background image. For more information about importing your own image, check out the uh, Change the Background to Import Your Own Image video. We'll slide back here and I'm going to pick this one on my home screen. Let's pick something different for the AV screen. We have a number of options for the AV screen as well, including some motion images on the AV screen. And a spectrum analyzer. And if we turn the volume up just a bit, we can see the spectrum analyzer in operation. And lastly is our clock setting over here. Here we have a number of different views for the clock, different fonts for the clock. These don't adjust the, uh, the time on the clock, they just adjust the look of the clock. And if I want to make the clock disappear from my screen, I can choose that one. So if I hit the X, you can see that there's no clock displayed up here. But I like to have the clock on my screen, so I'm going to touch the gears, come back to the clock setting, and I'll choose this one. And we'll hit the X to escape. 